In this short video, you will learn how to set up your My Pantry employee self-service account. First, you'll need to find your welcome email from Pantry. If it's not in your mailbox, check your spam or junk folder. If you still can't find it, contact your employer because they may not have sent it yet. Next, if you have not yet used My Pantry to access your pay stubs with an employer in the past, select register here and this will take you to the registration page. Here's where you'll fill in your personal information. You'll use the link code found in the welcome email. And for the zip code, it's important to use the zip code that your employer has on file for you. Once you do this, you'll receive an email confirmation. You'll want to check your spam, junk, or filtered emails. This will also be from pay entry. If you cannot locate this email, contact your employer and they can help. Once you've confirmed your email, you'll need to set up your security questions. These must be at least five characters, are case sensitive, and you can't use the same answer more than once. Once that's done, we'll move on to two-factor authentication. We want to protect your privacy and your data, which is why we have this step. I suggest that you set up the secondary authentication as well, because if you get a new cell phone number or it's died or been forgotten somewhere, it will be difficult to access your account if you do not have a secondary method. You can select a voice call, text message, or app authenticator. I'm going to use Google Authenticator and a text message. Congratulations, you've now securely set up your My Pay Entry account. Here's where you'll find your personal information on file with your employer, your pay stubs, benefit information, and more. If you have any questions or your experience issues, please contact your employer. They're the best person to assist.